Hello and welcome to Let's Play Final Fantasy. This is Chaos Blue, and I found the way out. Okay, before I go on, I'm gonna explain this floor. As it turns out, it's not that big, and it loops around on itself. And there's a really easy trick to find this that I didn't know. Uh, what you wanna do is go two spaces in any direction, then go two spaces diagonally from that. And you should find this. Or at least I think it's diagonally. <laughs> I might have actually gone that wrong. Uh, but it's two spaces one way, then two spaces another way. The other way may or may not be diagonally. So, yeah. Good luck with that. On to the final floor. The final floor! A really long bridge. The thing with this bridge is, it's really long, and this one area in the game where you can fight the dreaded WAR MECH! As seen in 8-Bit Theater. The thing with War Mech is, if you fight it, it's gonna kill you. There's no debate about it, it will kill you. It is literally stronger than Chaos, and, a, and it is stronger by a great amount. If you run into it, it'll kill you. It has a damaging effect that probably deals more damage than you have life. And it has more life than Chaos. So, yeah. You'll be dead. Um... So yeah, pretty much, if you're pl If you don't have some way to cheat, like, oh, I don't know, save <laughs> states... Well, you just pray you don't run into him. And it's not terribly common, but it can happen. Slime. Haven't fought those before, nor do I plan to now. Anyway, looks like I'm here. That's interesting. <laughs> Lightning erupts from the fiend's ball! So, you- <laughs> Wow, that was lame. Let's try that again. So, you have come this far! I, Tiamat, fiend of the wind, will now put an end to your adventure! So yeah, check it out. Tiamat, fiend of the wind, gonna put an end to her adventure. Or so she claims. Let's see how she does against a whole bunch of evasion and haste. <laughs> Same strategy as always. Make fighter hit as hard as humanly possible. Um. Huh. Also, casting the different A spells probably would not go and miss here. But I prefer to just... Well, as I already said, Tiamat is, has max... or is resistant to all elements. And I can't cast my level 8 non-elemental spell. So, yeah, I pr pretty much the only choice I have is to make fighter hit as hard as humanly possible. Something to note is, what do you mean ineffective? You mean I can't increase his speed anymore? Wow. I never thought that would happen. Huh. Anyway, like I was saying, to note is, um... This strategy, in, if you're playing the remake, temper is much more efficient than hate. It increases your damage faster, and for that matter, in the remake, you can hit a lot more consecutive times. The two, these two facts mean you can break the game even worse with haste and temper in the remake than you can in the original. And I think I've already, and I think at this point, I've proved that haste makes boss is a lot easier. In theory. 
Um, let's put it this way. Imagine if Fighter was hitting 20 times and he had twice as much strength. Yeah. It's sort of like that. Anyway, I think it's in a. Yep, it is. Time for some heal three. Actual heal three. <laughs> and. Yeah, actually. I don't really have. Oh, hey. Let's try slow, which I actually do have. I didn't think I have had it. <laughs> but that'll in further increase my defenses. Um... Plus healing people who aren't fighter. Always a good idea. Because, yeah. He's still a tank. Um... How much damage have I done by now, actually? Let's see... I've done at least 400 damage, I'd say. Maybe more. I'm gonna say that's 500. Again, maybe a little bit more. But it should be in that vicinity. And yet more fast, because it may still be effective. <laughs> And it's ineffective. Okay then. Although I will say, fighting chaos like this is actually going to be a lot harder than it is in the remake. <laughs> um, and they buffed up chaos in the remake, mi remake, mind you. At least the one on the Game Boy knows they did. But I have tested this before. Doing kill. In the remake, if you're spamming haste and temper, you can kill chaos, the boss of the game, in a few hits. Obviously, that's not going to happen in this playthrough, though. So it'll be an actual epic battle. Speaking of epic battles, instead of talking about the one after this, I should be talking about Tiamat. It's been pretty cool, actually. I mean, it's hit me with some pretty effective spells. If I wasn't, well, more prepared, let's use slow again. Then I would be in a lot of trouble. Probably. No, Lucy! Cat tried to climb onto my computer, and I do not want her doing that, for her obvious reasons. And slow is ineffective, of course it is. Um. 59? You really need those critical hits. Okay, um... I've lost count of TMS HP. <laughs> yeah. Pretty much. I think it's probably most suggestive, though. Having said that, I don't know how much HP it actually has. No idea. So let's see. Let's use this again. And because I have nothing better to do, I'm gonna use Ice 3. Yay! Easier to dodge, the physical attack. Um, actually, this is probably the longest boss battle I've had yet. <laughs> As I said before, I don't know how much HP TMN actually has. I know how much HP Chaos has, though. And I cannot see TMN having more than... Oh, hey, it's dead. Okay. <laughs> Somebody add up the damage, so I know. Actually, I've already done it by now. 
not out of damage. I mean, fog chaos. So it's really not an issue. Um, you know, that's actually not that much m money anymore. It's a good amount of experience for one enemy, but actually not that much money. But hey, I leveled up with fighter. Probably just fighter. As it turns out, soloing two bosses kind of puts you pretty far in the lead, experience-wise. And after that, I don't think Fighter has died even once. Although, to be perfectly fair, that's partially from luck at not getting targeted with hits from kill spells. But it's mostly because he's a bloody tank, and most of my strategies revolve around him. So... Where is the... Okay, well that's done. Uh -huh. Well, here's the thing. Remember when I said that about the when I was talking about the two swords? I'm gonna run away. Um well I only got one of those swords. And I guess it's possible somebody give this to me? But I really thought I got it from, you know, that. So that leaves me sort of confused. Did I, like, pick it up on the way? Wait, what? Oh, for this is being chaos. I missed it. This is being chaos blue with Let's Play Final Fantasy. Until next time, see ya. Hey, this is Chaos Blue, and welcome back. Remember this floor? Cause I sure do. Well, guess what? That thing, the other thing I need for the second best sword in the game, the knight's best sword, it's right here. It is the adamant! And I actually have it now. Man. So, 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 so bad. Okay, then. Um, yeah, I'm getting out of this place right now. I just climbed all the way back up. Like, well, yeah. Right now. No, running away. Screw off. I need to go make, take the adamant and turn it into the second best sword in the game. Once I get there. And then it's just the final dungeon. Like I said, I'm gonna finish this tonight. Ah. Thank you, fighter. Now then, to the airship. I can probably land there. Sandworms! Run away from the sandworms! Because they're a waste of time! As is healing. But no! I had to climb all, all of the tower. I'm not cutting out any battles until I get the damn sword. <laughs> so too bad. I just need to get on the airship, like so. Fly down until I hit land, like so. Fly left until I hit the right bit of land, like. Wait for it. 
too far. Like so? Land? Go into Tortuga? Great place, Tortuga. And talk to... Wait for it? Smithy the Smith. Adamant! Now let me make the sword for you! Here, the best work I've ever done! It is my gift. Behold! Excalibur! This sword, as I said, is the best in the game, best for, no for a fighter, and yeah, it's just a really strong sword. Fun fact about the sword, actually. Um, it, if this wasn't the glitched up original version, would deal extra damage to everything. Don't ask me how that works, but apparently, uh, the portal is such that it is the same property as the fire sword or ice sword or all the other ones, where they deal extra damage to specific enemies, except it applies to everything, in addition to being, the sec statistically, the second strongest weapon. Anyway, I'm gonna prepare for the final dungeon. And uh, my voice is sore. So, yeah. Until next time, this has been Chaos Blue. See ya.